different cultures and religious traditions, people have daily rituals to stay connected with the divine or to strengthen and empower themselves. In Santeria, people give offerings, Christians pray, Buddhists have group meditation, and draconian practitioners have several techniques used to master the mind and body. Our daily rituals help build a foundation to grow more advanced skills that can be useful in invocations, path workings, or other rituals later on in your path. Our daily rituals can be complex or mundane as we choose, and for every practitioner, different things work best. It is the most important part of your practice as daily rituals are one of the first steps in creating your own path. Draconian practitioners must stay connected with the current and take care of our spiritual body. Practices like grounding and empowering are essential in keeping your body and mind balanced. The excess or absence of energy can cause depression, obsessive tendencies, violent thoughts or emotions, Daily rituals also build up your kundalini or inner dragon force and allow you to practice using your inner fire, a useful, essential, and very versatile energy we work with on the path. Daily rituals also give you a chance to learn how to direct and manipulate your own energy as well. If you fail to cleanse your space, it can attract astral parasites, energy vampires, and make your ritual space stagnant and dangerous. Cleansing techniques can include going on a walk, opening a window, burning blue sage or palo santo, even ringing a bell or a simple shower. You can also perform visualization techniques or use the most powerful cleansing force, your inner fire. Grounding helps you release an excess of energy and bring your mind back to the present. A lack of grounding can result in delusions or confusion and sometimes insanity since your mind is not used to the powerful energies that we work with. Grounding techniques can include cleaning your space, watching TV, talking to other people, or going outdoors. In the beginning of your practice, these simple grounding practices may seem nice and work fine, but it is important to learn grounding visualizations in order to grow your ability to direct energy. And because further in your path, these more complex rituals where you interact with powerful forces and shift your consciousness in the ritual space will create a need for you to really, truly ground yourself. One of the most important things on the beginning of your path is raising and storing energy. Before you try to manifest curses or money and love spells, it is important to build your power and become as strong as you can. The more dedication and self-discipline you put into understanding and utilizing these daily rituals in your practice, the more powerful you can become. Empowering rituals can also help give you a burst of energy throughout the day and really boost the kundalini flow within your body, enhancing your mind and allowing you to work with more amounts of energy. Daily rituals also allow the practitioner to practice self-discipline, which is an extremely important part of the path. You must perform your daily rituals and care for your spiritual body every single day, no excuses. Self-discipline is one of the most important and useful tools you will use on the draconian path and for your personal evolution. The foundation of a strong self comes from small acts of self-discipline. More essays, rituals, and other information regarding the temple, our projects, and upcoming publications can be found on our website, which is ascendingflame.com. And if you have any questions about our publications, feel free to email us at infoascendingflame.com.